Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today you guys, I got some good old comfort food, some homemade chili. This is my mother's recipe for her homemade chili. I don't know everything that she puts in it, but it's delicious. Um, packed with meat. I dress mine up with some cheese, some cherry cheese. Not some, a lot. <laughs> Um, kind of pour some in, mix it up so it can get all nice and melted and ooey gooey in there. I'm going to pour some more because I love cheese. Okay. How's everybody been? Hopefully everybody has been doing lovely. Me, myself, I am great. See, it's already gooey. Look at that. Yummy. Um, so, well, hot sauce first. You guys have ran out of the crystal hot sauce. So I'm using some Tabasco. Now I have to add my own hot sauce because um, my mom is really not too much into the spice. Add some sour cream. You can add um, chopped white onions, would be delicious. Whatever you want. Um, like my mom, like my parents, they eat just rice with their chili. I don't. I like mine with Frito scoops. So, you guys, it's cold and wet and rainy outside, so it's the perfect time for some good old yummy, warm comfort foods, things that are going to keep you nice and warm on the inside. Oh, here you guys go. First bite for you. Mmm. <laughs> You know, we spent, us monk mongers, we spent so much time working on the presentation. Uh. Mm -hmm. What are you guys eating with me? And what's the weather like out there where you live? All right, I'm in California, so California is so unpredictable. A couple days ago, it was 70 degrees. Yesterday, we were fine, everything. Weather was, you know, ugly outside, a little gloomy, but it wasn't cold or anything. And just all of a sudden, boom, starts raining. So it rained a little bit today, too. I don't know if it's gonna rain tomorrow. I like the rain when I'm in the house. I don't like the rain when I'm outside. I hate driving in the rain. If I can avoid it, I will. These people drive so crazy. I don't know why. I guess they feel like, oh, it's raining. I have to drive like a maniac. Mmm. Mmm. Can you guys see the food? I hope so. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. This is so good. Super cheesy.
Mm. Here comes trouble, y'all. Here comes cupcake. Baby, sit down. Did you eat your food? You did. You ate all your food. Good girl. You have to wait till I'm done filming. So my dog is trained that she gets a treat when she finishes her food. So she has come to tell me that she ate all her food. She's ready for her treat. Mm. It'll be good in here too. I'm dipping some bread. I just bought a fresh pack of some Hawaiian sweet rolls. I'm tempted to go get them, y'all. someone asked I did um her mom's chili mukbang before I did a mukbang on my mother's chili before and someone asked for the recipe um that's up to my mother whether or not she wants to give that or not there's certain dishes and certain recipes that just stay within the family <laughs> there's certain dishes and certain recipes that not everybody in their family knows how to make Too. It's been a long but productive day at work. I tried to pause the video. I didn't, and you know, everybody was complaining about getting that alert message about Texas or whatever from the press or from, yeah, them. I didn't get it. are too heavy and nosy cup is going to investigate you know those fruit baskets that are like you know round and then they have that little hook on top where you can hang your bananas that's what I have and it fell over mm. 
Sorry guys, if you can hear the TV in the background, my apologies. Um, my nephew Dakari is here. We're babysitting him while his mother, while his parents are out of town. And um, he's watching the Berestein, Berestein Bears. Comment down below if you remember the Berestein Bears from back in the day. Mmm. so good. Ooh. Hold on guys, I'll be right back. Cupcake is signaling that she needs to go outside. I'll be back. I'm back. <sighs> so good mm. guys do me a favor thumbs up this video comment down below and subscribe if you haven't already done so on the side of the subscription button is a notification bell if you hit the bell twice you'll be notified every time that I upload a video feel free to share my videos with everybody so they can see all this yummy goodness on these cold days rainy days mm. I can't wait for my next comfort food mukbang I already know what I'm making. I can't wait. Mm. Mm. I I ordered a DNA kit from Ancestry.com. There's no particular reason why. I mean, it's not because I'm not trying to find anything out or anything, but my friend at work <clears throat> um, ordered one and her results came back. And she was a little shocked at what she thought she was, her ethnicity, background, whatever. It was completely the opposite. Or not the opposite, but nothing in her radar. It was super cool to find out. You know, she thought she was, um, well, she's a mixed race. Her mother is white, but she was always told her father was black and Indian. Come to find out she's black and Italian. So it was cool. It was, you know, it was interesting. So a couple of us coworkers ordered the test. <laughs> I 
think they have more interest in where they come from than I do. I, um, I mean, I'll find out just to find out, but there's nothing that I'm like looking for. And I don't think there's anything that can really shock me. Like if, if it said, you know, I was Japanese, I would not be shocked. If it said, I was Polish, I would not be shocked. <laughs> if it said I was, I don't know, Nigerian, I would not be shocked. Our family is a rainbow. We have so much mixed up in us. Um, so whatever comes back, it's not going to shock me. The only thing I would be shocked about <laughs> is if my mother was not my mother. That's the only thing I'd be shocked about because we are twins. Someone cloned her to make me. Or I'm her clone, I should say. Um, that's the only thing that would shock me. So I guess with this DNA um, thing, they could tell you where you're from and if there are any relatives that also did it and they kind of match you up or whatnot. So if someone popped up and it said mother and it wasn't my mother, then I'd be shocked. <laughs> but she can't deny me. She knows I'm her mini me. But anything else that shows up, I mean, I think it's fun to know. It's interesting, but I would not be shocked at all. So it's actually funny at work because we all kind of got, sorry, kind of got some bets going. People are teasing each other. <laughs> So, I might share my results with you guys during a mukbang. We'll see. Not sure if you guys are even interested. Or let me know if you've done um, Ancestry.com and what were you looking for? And were there any surprises? Like... A friend, somebody popped up that was a potential brother. Where does brother come from? So, <laughs> those type of shocking things. You guys, my chili's almost gone. Whoa. really good though sometimes it's even better the next day I don't know if I want to eat a chili cheese dog tomorrow or just more chili maybe some chili cheese fries mm -hmm. all I know is this is good Yummy, yummy. Mm. I am getting a little bit full, y'all. I don't want to be stuffed. Mm. Mm. I didn't really give y'all no more, huh? Not bad. I 
because I don't I don't prefer doing mukbangs after work. I prefer doing them on the weekend or on a day off. I'm always too tired after work. chips left. Mm. Hey. Try not to make a mess. Mm. I was going to say welcome. Did you already say that? I don't think so. Welcome. To all my new subscribers, I truly appreciate you guys subscribing. You guys are great. Thank you for the support and thank you for the love. Um, thank you to my day ones and to my loyal viewers. I really appreciate you guys. Um, you guys are some... Uh, Ride or dies. Love it. Love it. Love it. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up. Thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, don't forget to thumbs it up. Comment down below. Hit that subscription button. Hit that notification bell. Share this video. I truly, truly, truly appreciate it. I will see you guys on the next video. I don't know in what order these videos are going to be released, um, but I I'm planning to do a another comfort food mukbang. I may do a cook with me. I might turn it into a cook with me. We'll see. And I'm overdue for a seafood boil, you guys. I have everything that I need. I just don't have the time <laughs> to cook it. So hopefully um, in the next couple of days I can add a seafood boil or at least a seafood boil video. Okay, I'm getting sleepy now. So I will see you guys on the next video. Once again, thank you so much for the love and support. I truly appreciate you guys. Talk to you guys, or see you guys later. Bye.